based blogger. I love to keep busy and stay active by trying new things in the Ottawa region. Follow my adventures as I try new activities and get out of my comfort zone. Today's experience was exhilarating. I got to drive a race car, coached by a professional race car driver at the Calabogie Motorsports Park. It was tough to get started because I don't normally drive standard, but once I got going, it was really fun. We learned a lot about corner theory and how to take corners at high speed. Not something I'll be doing when I'm driving down the street, but super fun nonetheless. Today I'm going to the Calabogie Motorsports Park to do some race car driving. I'm really excited about this activity. It's probably the episode that I'm most excited for because it's not something you get to do very often. Feeling really well rested and ready to go. Have a great day driving the cars. We're on our way there right now. Really excited to meet the guys and get out on the racetrack. Good to see you. You too, Travis. Awesome. So we're at Calabogie Motorsports Park. We're gonna jump in the Mustangs today for a Mustang experience. Are you ready to go? Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Do you have any experience being at a racetrack like this? Uh, not driving cars, but I used to be a competitive cyclist, so I did okay. the Calabogie Road Race that happens here in April. Awesome. So the only difference now is we're adding two more tires and a little Perfect. bit more speed. Cool. Cool. Let's go. All right. A lot going on and that's one thing that I want to work with you on and you'll see as we're driving when we come into a corner we'll take turn one for example this is a long right hander mm -hmm. and you had it bang on you want to go from the outside to the inside to the outside and the whole purpose of that is to open up the radius of the corner you want to keep your thumbs in here that's why they get worn all here oh, okay and you want to just pull down with your thumbs the reason for that is if you if you were to push with this outside arm you're using forearm and shoulder muscles mm -hmm. They're not nearly as precise as thumb and wrists. Gotcha. You want to keep between 45 and 90 degree bend in your elbows and a bit of a bend in your legs. What that does is it gives you three things for your legs. One, you have more strength to hit the brake pedal. When we brake hard on a racetrack, you're braking harder than you typically would on a car. Okay. So instead of using ankle muscle, you're going to use more quad. Okay. And that's going to allow you to push. <laughs> Also notice I'm not really stiff on the steering wheel. Okay. 
I want to be nice and smooth so I'm not jerking the car around too much. Do you undo it? You just turn yeah. this. Oh, yeah. So does this one stay done? Yep. Okay, awesome. I'm going to get you to turn the key on. All the way. Going to want to use the clutch when oh, we go right. to start the car. So we are still driving the standard. So clutch all the way down. This is our start button. So you're good with the key now. Okay. Now just push this. Now. Day race car driving at the Calabogie Motorsports Park. Thanks to Travis Hill and the rest of the team for making it happen. Can't wait to get home, get some rest. If you haven't already, check out the rest of the episodes in the series, and I'll see you next time. So that was my adventure today. I'll see you in the next post.